Other parts of the world have had two previous Audi RS3s, both of which were hatchbacks powered by turbocharged five-cylinder engines featuring a cast iron block. The first was launched in 2011 as a limited to Europe special edition spun from the previous generation S3. The second, which made its debut in 2015, basically transplanted the same power plant into the current generation hatch. But now this new sedan variant has coincided with a switch to the same aluminum block turbocharged 2.5 liter inline 5 that we've already driven in the TTRS US sales of the 2017 RS3 sedan are set to start in the summer. The combination of a small car with a big engine remains a compelling one, and the RS's 400 horsepower output is pretty much exactly the right amount of too much. The RS3's maximum torque output of 354 pounds ft is available from 1700 to 5850 rpms and is a substantial increase over the 280 pounds ft of the S3. The wheel arches are filled by the standard 19-inch pieces, which are clad in the scantiest of Pirelli P0s. The car we drove had wider 255 30s or 19s at the front to go along with the standard 235 35ths or 19s at the rear. This engine loves to be worked hard all the way to the 7200 RPM fuel cutoff if the mood takes you, but it still feels deep chested and impressively rapid at a 5 tenths pace. The gearbox works very well, smoothing shifts nicely when left in drive. One of the standout qualities of the RS3 is how civilized it feels when used gently, but also managing whip crack changes under manual control and with the drive select system in its more aggressive dynamic mode.